Hello everybody, it's King back here on our video. Today guys, we're back with some LEGO Marvel superheroes. Uh, let's get straight into the gameplay. Now, before we do, i just like to mention that as... <laughs> Bro, he came out of nowhere. Thank you for interrupting my intro. Um, so as you guys can see, there's an 8 times multiplier in the top, I want to say, left corner. The reason for that is because we went ahead and we got the red pool, uh, uh, red brick. In, like in between episodes I technically recorded the experience but quite frankly it wasn't the best video I had to um I had to replay the level like twice because there was a glitch that happened where like uh, the puzzle that we were doing got stuck and it wouldn't move any longer so we had to completely exit out the whole level replay it all again from the start basically it's not even like that big of a deal it's just one puzzle where you have to get three trophies to line up on like color match basically and we went ahead and we did it, and now we have an 8 times multiplier, because it doesn't mean we got an, um, a times 8 multiplier. What happens is we have the times 2 and the times 4, and they stack to create a times 8. Which is why I was saying, once we get like the, um, the times 4 red brick, we're going to be getting mad, mad amount of suds. Now, before I continue on to the video, I just want to quickly mention something, because technically I I'll have already made like an update video by the time you guys are watching this episode because I'm pre-recording this episode in advance however I still feel the need to address it so I apologize for the uh, problems with the videos in the past few days like I honestly don't know what's been happening apparently and I didn't realize this until literally uh I want to say yesterday because like I said this video is probably gonna go a day or two in advance but I genuinely didn't know that my computer was having like a video file problem where like, the, the file that actually holds all the videos, it was glitching up mad hard. And I don't know why. I don't know what's happening to it. I don't know what the cause of it is. It's just been tripping. Like, to, to give you an idea of how bad it is, usually, if you would want, like, if you're, okay, how do I explain this? If you're on your computer right now, go to files, go to download, okay? Look at how quickly, like, if you did it, like, if you were following my words, right? Look at how quickly you were able to open that file. I did the exact same process to get into my video file, and it straight up took half an hour to load this morning, just to post my video, and I was like, what, or, like I said, I'm recording this in advance, so this morning doesn't apply to, like, the day this video is posted, but to the day, um, episode, I want to say 12 came out, like, um, the one with the dinosaurs, that's, that day, it literally took me half an hour to open my video file, and I'm like, why, like, like, I, I didn't even realize that it had a problem, why until like yesterday trip? like it uploaded a duplicate episode right which i again i didn't notice and i was like okay maybe i just i miss accidentally like uploaded the same video twice so i was like whatever and then the very next day it messed up again and i was like oh come on now i was like all right that's stupid so clearly something is happening as of right now i still haven't fixed it i i have no idea what's happening quite frankly i'm, I'm just gonna have to be more careful when i like maneuver around that file and I'm gonna try to see if I can like reboot my computer or like like run like, an antivirus or I'm not like I said I have no idea what's happening but I will definitely be fixing it for we've the future all of our data from every shield we're also very close to finishing this world. game which is a, a good thing you know pros and cons I guess definitely up to something bad wow really I, know that's not much to go on, but I was about to, to say right? I was about to say hey Maria really they're up to something bad I would never have guessed that's crazy like, come on, now clearly they're up to something bad. Ugh. Also, I, I, like, I'll admit that the past few videos haven't been the best quality-wise. Um, I'll probably get into that again in the upload video, so I don't want to make this video, like, a huge bummer. I'd rather leave that for its own specific video. So, oh, hold up. That may soon be unleashed by hold up. He must be stopped. I'm gonna stop talking, I'm gonna let this happen first, and then I'll talk, but I- Oh, oh, no, 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 I'm gonna wait, I'm gonna wait, I'm gonna wait. Soon, all on Earth will bow to do. Yo. The Earth. It's such an important part of my revenge. Thanks, but we'll do all the avenging around here. And looky, Loki and his pal have a big bad mega weapon. Bro, the fact that they all gathered up means we're very, very close to the end of the game. I have created this doom ray to defend the planet from destruction. Also to destroy all resistance to my benevolent rule. Defend the Earth? From what? I'll hold them off. You finish my weapon. Excellent suggestion. Fools, this place is mine to rule. Oh, I thought he was mind controlling him and I was about to say, hey, I literally knew it. At your service. 
You can't possibly defeat me. I really thought he was about to just mind control him, and I was like, oh my god, I knew it. I've known it for so long. But now, apparently, he was giving him a power up. I swear to god, I thought he took off old pretenses, and I was like, let's go. Big genius up in the house. But nah, guess I was wrong. <laughs> I mean, it's still not too. It's still too early to say if I was wrong or not. I really, really still believe Loki is the main mastermind. I really do. You think Doctor Doom and Loki are the kind of guys who share power? Not in the slightest. To our advantage. Yeah, no, they, they are not sharing any kind of power, bro. Don't even. No, nah, don't get it twisted. They are definitely not going to share this power. Um, although. I think maybe we only have like four episodes left in this game and then we're kind of done with it so then we can start exploring the open world right while also playing marvel avengers i am so hyped it's gonna be such a such a turning point like it's gonna be crazy uh you get to die and you get to die. oh so many studs bro so many studs. look at this oh so nice so 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 nice yeah so great all right, uh, unfortunately, we don't have... Ooh, blue stud that was hiding back here? I see. I see you, Snoo Sneaky. I was about to say Snooky. I don't know what Snooky is, but it's not a word. <laughs> sneaky little blue stud, you. All right, let's go up here. Let's destroy this real quick. All right. The spider sense is tingling. Uh, spider sense. Okay, let's pitch over this. Let's spitch over? Wow, that's great. I love when my words don't make any sense. <laughs> it's just going to be one of those kind of days, I guess. All right, let's... Oh, uh, bro, like, I I've mentioned this before, but I love, love, love Spidey's um, projectile combat. Like, him and Iron Man are the most fun to use. Like, they genuinely, genuinely are. And that's not just because I love both Spider-Man and, and Iron Man. It's just the way their projectiles work is so nice. Because, like, Iron Man basically one-shots everyone who gets hit immediately, right? And then the way Spider-Man works is he may not one-shot... Oh, let's go. True Believer already. Let's go. That is so nice. We literally just started and we're already True Believer. You can you can just guess how much we're going to be getting. You know what I mean? Just, just from that, you're going to guess how much we can end at this episode. You know what? Actually, go ahead in the comments down below. Uh, post how much you think we're going to get. You know what I mean? I go ahead and guess, and I, I don't know, I, I was gonna say I'll, I'll reward whoever does, but I can't really reward, <laughs> I don't have anything to reward anybody with, so I guess, you'll get pinned, you know what, you'll get pinned and you'll get a heart in your comments, I don't really know, yeah, you, yeah. alright, let's go there, yeah, I don't really didn't think that through, I was like, yeah, reward, and I was like, actually, I have nothing to reward anybody with, <laughs> that was, <laughs> oh, that's a Captain America thing, but we don't have Captain America right now, so that's, do we? Hold up, was, has Cap been down there and I'm just not paying attention? Because I'm not going to hold you. Cap, like, always goes unnoticed for me. I don't, I don't know. Maybe, maybe he was here. I don't know. Uh, let me destroy it. See, that's... I love Spider-Man's uh, range projectile. What I hate, however, is the fact that he doesn't have a slam attack. Oh, Cap is here. Okay. I knew that. I clearly knew that. I mean, obviously... He's been here since the very beginning, and I mean, I'm obviously so um, observative that I can notice that Captain America has been with us the entire time. Bro, <laughs> like, yo, it's 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 crazy the amount of shade I've been showing, showing Cap throughout this entire series. I mean, genuine. I compared him with Hawkeye, for the love of God. Bro, like, the amount of shade. He does not deserve all the shade, bro. Honestly, I feel kind of bad for him at this point. Uh, let's switch up the storm here and build up some lightning force. Uh, let's switch up the thing actually first, just because there's a bunch of. Yeah, hey, I didn't even know that was a mini kit. I was just. Okay. So we have to destroy five of those kind of lab things. Which is like, we could definitely do so. Uh, let me just see if there are any others. Nope, just making it. Just, so it always helps to be um, attentive to detail. Alright, let's grab that up here. Uh, mm hmm. Alright. Yeah, right, she can't fly. Great. <laughs> it makes so much sense to not allow her to fly. <laughs> I know I've mentioned this like hundreds of times, but it's so annoying. It's so, so annoying. Like I've said, I can understand why they wouldn't let Jean Grey fly, alright? Like, because technically what she does isn't really flying. It's kind of just like pulling herself up with her own telekinetic abilities. So I understand if you wouldn't allow her to fly. But really? You won't allow Storm to fly? How does that make any sense? Like, literally almost all of her famous comic panels have her in the middle of the air. How are you gonna tell me she can't fly? Oh, my God. 
Oh, I almost died there. I was like, nope, switch real quick. Okay, what are these little cube things? I don't know how to interact with these things. I'm assuming they're they're made out of black bricks. Maybe, maybe that's why we can't interact with them. We need a cosmic character. But that's just my assumption, because I have no idea how I'm supposed to do this. Alright, let's do that. Let's go up here. Switch up the cap. Come on, where are you, cap? There we go. Double jump, and... Yep. I'm not going to hold you. Uh, the audio feels kind of low. I don't know why, but like... It feels kind of low, so I'm gonna see if I can bump it. Give me a sec here, let me see. Uh, nope, it's on 7. I don't actually know what's happening. But the audio feels kind of low for this level. Like, the music and everything is kind of, kind of quiet. Yeah, it's kind of quiet, which I'm worried it's gonna make it so that, like, my voice is too loud. Uh, I think they had safety perfectly in mind, just not our safety. That's the caveat right there. Yeah, I don't, I don't think they very much care about intruders. <laughs> Alright, let's uh, deflect this. I'm also genuinely glad we uh, have the thing instead of the Hulk. Because Hulk's been getting too much screen time, but the thing hasn't been used all that often. And even though I'm not a Ben Grimm fan, I feel kind of bad, man. He's, he's cool in his own right. He honestly doesn't get that much love, even in comics in general. He's just he's kind of a very underrated character. I mean, I understand why, right? It's, it's very difficult to, oh, uh, we need a silver thing to destroy that wall to get that mini kit. But we don't have anybody who could do that. Alright, I guess that's another thing we're going to have to take care of once uh, we start the open world series. And re start replaying these missions and capturing all of the characters and doing all that good stuff. Alright, let's go storm here. Uh, Alright, let's build up a thunder force. Also, for those who, uh, just because just I don't think I've spoken about the specifics of my plan, I don't plan on redoing any of the chapter missions until we've unlocked the majority of the characters that can be unlocked throughout the open world. And the reason for that is because it's a lot, it's going to be a lot cooler to replay the missions while having, like, a broad variety of characters we can use to, like, complete the different, like, um, minigames and stuff, you feel? Well, because, like, if we go through it right now, we're only gonna keep being- We're only gonna, like, keep using the same characters over and over again, despite the fact that we'll have- or So, like, we'll keep using Spider-Man for, like, uh, like, special census areas. We'll keep using, um, like, I don't know, Jean Grey for, like, psych psychic areas instead of using, like, characters that we could unlock later on. You feel? So instead of doing that, I'd actually rather wait until we unlock the majority of characters, and then we can go back and replay the missions. So, because then that one, like, one time we can use Jean Grey, and then, like, the next time we can use another telepath, which, like, I don't even know who's gonna be a telepath in this game. I know in this game, there's several options for basically everything except, um, magnetics. The only characters who can, who have magnetic characters are Magneto. And then Polaris, which is Magneto's daughter. And th those are the only two who have magnetic characters in the entire game. Which is highly, highly unfortunate. But I guess there's nothing really you can do. Alright, let's switch over to Spidey here. As soon as Spidey decides to be cooperative. There we go. Alright. There we go. Oh man, I am a hype type, bro. Oh, I so want to finish this game. I'm so hyped. I know I've been in space before, but that's... Whoa, indeed. Alright, I'm gonna have to, you know what? Yeah, there we go. There we go. Yeah, I, I finally used my brain there for a sec. Oh, but this is actually a beautiful level. Uh, okay. So we're gonna need a flying character, I guess, because... Oh, okay, so we're supposed to use Storm, who apparently can't fly but can hover. Because this makes so much sense. Like, <laughs> bro, why would you not give her the ability to fly? It doesn't make any sense. <laughs> like, it's so stupid. Ugh. So stupid, bro. So dumb. Like, out of all the characters who didn't get abilities, who should have gotten ability, You know what? I might just make a list. I really might make a list of all the characters who should have certain powers who didn't get them. For example, like... Dr. Octopus is able to use telekin- uh, Dr. Octopus is able to interact with tech panels, right? But Spidey isn't, which makes no sense, because they're in a similar level of intelligence. Like, it's- it's so dumb, bro. So, so dumb. Uh, we need to switch attack here. 
Okay, there's way too many enemies right now. I'm gonna die again. God damn it. Slam. Oh, god damn. Okay, you know what? Alright. I really need this thing to break. And then I can switch to, uh, not him. I can switch to the thing and do this. There we go. No more enemies. Wasn't that easy. Alright, everybody get out. Oh my god, get out of my way so I can collect these damn studs. Yo. God damn. We need a, um, we need an ejector button. Just throw everybody else out this goddamn... We really need an ejector button so we can just launch everyone who's in our way outside of the station. Also, I don't know about you guys, but I could never go in this tube. Superpowers or not, bro, my fear of heights is already crazy, but like, oh, fear of being in space? Nah, the view is beautiful, but if I was just standing out here? Nah, uh, mm -mm, no way. I would faint right there and then. Don't even, bro, nah. Because I was thinking about it, right? I was like, oh, this is such a beautiful view. I kind of actually wish I would, like, have the experience. And I was like, actually, hold up. I never want this experience. I'm tripping, bro. I don't want this experience ever. Uh. Okay. I was about to say, what are we supposed to do here? Because this is not a lightning panel. But I guess we're supposed to destroy this and then build a lightning panel. Yeah, see? Yeah, big brain right here. I only had to play, like, 14 missions to finally get the hang of how LEGO games work. <laughs> Ah, there we go. Oh, I thought he was about to slip again. I was like, oh no. Come on, man. Uh, Alright, Spidey. There we go. Oh, damn it. Damn it. I had him for a sec. There we go. Oh, uh, bro. I love his web slinging animation. Like, I've mentioned. <laughs> bro, Lego the thing what about Lego it? games is no matter what, like, media i guess they choose the moment they release a game Warning. based on that media it imme is not safe proceeding is not advised yeah they always say that yeah they always say that i agree nah but the moment they make like a game right for a certain media it immediately becomes the best game for that media like for example um and this is something i'm considering doing but like not into the late late future because it's going it's gonna be quite a, uh, a little bit of money and I'm like I'm not gonna I don't have the finances right now but if you guys are like if you guys want to see it in the future um the Lego Skywalker saga right that like that that game came out right and it is from what I've seen everybody's been talking about how great it is how amazing it is how it's probably one of like the best um Star Wars games and I'm like yeah that's the thing about Lego games right no matter what sort of like media they choose to make a game about a slow the moment it comes out it immediately becomes one of the best games for that sort of genre like when it chose to make a marvel game it immediately became one of the best marvel games you feel like and that's just how it works and it's kind of it's actually really cool because here's the thing right lego marvel's avengers right we'll play that very soon and then oh sorry i was trying really hard not to hiccup on camera there but like as I was saying, Lego Marvel's Avengers, right? We'll be playing that very, very soon. And I genuinely, genuinely don't think there's another Avengers game, right? Avengers specific game that can match up to Lego Marvel's Avengers, despite it being a Lego game, right? Now, of course, take take what I'm saying with a grain of salt, right? You have to remember, I don't have much gaming experience. Maybe there are better games out there. But from what I've heard, right? I would, I would honestly make a bet that lego marvel's avengers probably like offers a gaming experience that's m as fun you know what i mean that's equal to at the very least to some of the best Mar uh avengers games out there I, like honestly quite frankly and it's just because like the games give you so much like i can't really describe it right but anybody who's played a lego game has said the same thing and it's all over, like, whatever the LEGO games I see, right, whenever I'm looking at them, whenever the, it's the comments, the forums, anything, it's always the same thing. People are always praising the games for how good they are of that, like, sort of, like, media. Like, I was watching a LEGO Marvel's review, right, like, from way, way back when it was first released. Oh, hold up. I guess the door lady wasn't joking. I guess the door lady wasn't joking. Yeah, you think? I'm just trying to grab studs right now, bro. I know we're gonna I know we're gonna miss a mini kit. I know we're going to miss a mini kit. Like, I already know it's so obvious we're gonna miss a mini kit. I just don't care. Cause I'm not I know I'm not gonna be able to get it on my first try. So oh never mind. There wasn't a single mini kit. Never mind. Alright, you know what? That was a cool shot for at least a second. 
Remind me not to take the scenic route next time. <laughs> Give him a little shake. This is, oh, this is so cool. We're so close to the end of the game, bro. I'm so hyped. Yo, I'm so hyped. Oh, this is such a cool shot. This is such a cool shot. Bow before your savior of Earth. Bow before Doom. Yeah, my boy Doom. The tanker incident. All right, all right, all right. All right, I really want to finish this. But we're already 20 minutes in. And the thing is, is ah The thing is is that we don't know how if this is if this boss fight is gonna be the end of this mission. We don't know. It seems like it's going to be, but we just don't know. I don't mm, I don't wanna risk Nah, you know what? We're risking, we're risking, we're risking, we're risking. You cannot stop me now. We'll, we'll risk it, bro. We'll do it. We'll do it. Yeah, no, 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 no. Okay, you know what? I'm not. Yep, yep, yep. Spidey has a has a blaster type ability, so it's gonna be the only way. I'm just going. Okay, eight more. There we go. And then probably the rest are over here somewhere. Oh, never mind. Things actually been taking care of them pretty decently. All right. Twip, twip. Yeah, twip, twip away. There we go. All right. Let me just go ahead and collect all these here. Ah, oh, damn. Uh, th here's the problem with Spider-Man, he can't hover off the ground, like, that's kind of annoying, but... Like, not hover off the ground, what I mean is that he can't web-swing... He can't web-swing close enough to the ground where he can, like, pick up the studs that are there. This is it, I am your doom! Oh, hold up, Mega Doom Bot? I actually kind of, uh, I really hope we can play with this man later on. Like, I'm really hoping we can play with this man later on. Um, how do we beat him though? Like, I don't. Do we? Do we? Can we go and punch him now? No. How do I beat him? Uh. Yeah. You know what? Switch. Oh, hold up. Only big figs can hit big figs, right? Is that is that what's going on? Is that now what's happening? How are we supposed to beat him? Okay, I genuinely don't know what's... Alright, you know what? I, I genuinely don't know if we should continue this episode because I don't know how much longer this is going to be. Like, I don't know. How are we supposed to beat this man? Because, like, we're here, you feel? Okay. You know what? Alright, alright, alright. I've come to a decision. We're going to end this episode here. We're going to end this episode here. And we will start part two right afterwards. Because, like I said, I don't know if this boss fight is going to be the end. And judging from the way this uh, this boss fight is already going, it's probably going to take me a little while to figure out how to complete this boss fight. And it might not even be the end of the mission. So, that's all for today's episode. I hope you all had a wonderful day. If you haven't, I hope it turns into a great and wonderful day. And we will be right back with part two.